Perth's northern rail line now stretches all the way to Butler following a $221 million rail extension. The new Butler station opened three months early and came in $20 million under budget. Welcome, my name is Rhys Warlock and it is a great pleasure on behalf of the PDA to welcome you to the latest addition to the Transperth network, Butler Station. It's part of the state government's planned $1.9 billion investment in public transport infrastructure over four years. Transport Minister Dean Nowder says the extension will ease traffic congestion in the area and take the pressure off other nearby train stations. It includes a seven and a half kilometre uh, rail extension, 930 car bays, uh, 11 new buses that will link uh, from Yanship and Two Rocks into the station. WA Premier Colin Barnett handed over to the community of Butler and surrounding suburbs to officially open the station. OK, one, two, three. Well done, it is open, congratulations. People don't need to drive to Clarkson. It's much easier, you can walk here to the train station, it's really just around the corner and it opens up for a lot of people in Yentrip and Turok as well. We normally catch the train at Clarkson, but obviously this is far nearer for us and there's obviously more opportunity for parking vehicles at the moment as well, so we're quite happy about that. Public Transport Authority CEO Rhys Waldock says it's an exciting day for residents of the growing northern suburbs. I've been around for a long time in public transport and I can say, out of our 70 stations, this is our best, best I say, best station in the whole suburban system. So I think it's great for us, great for um, PDA, but even better for the people of Putnam in the northern suburbs.